our world is one incredible place. It's filled with plants, animals, and resources that allow us to enjoy our lives. That's why it's so important that we look after our planet's resources. Because without them, life would be very different. So, what is a resource? A resource is something that is used by people to help them live. They can be natural or man-made. We use resources every day, from the fresh water we drink to the electricity that powers our homes. It's almost like magic. Turn on a tap and water gushes out in an instant. Or flick a switch and the entire room lights up. But resources don't appear out of thin air. They all come from somewhere. And when we don't use them properly, there can be serious consequences for our world. What can we do to make sure we're using our resources thoughtfully? Introducing the four R's. The four R's stand for refuse, reduce, reuse, and recycle. If everyone follows the four R's, together we can work to use our resources sensibly and keep our planet healthy. What does each R mean? Refuse means saying no to things we don't need. When you're about to use something that you're probably going to throw away straight after, like a plastic straw, think, do I really need to use this? If the answer is no, then say no thanks. Instead, you could drink your smoothie with a reusable straw, or even better, no straw at all. Reduce means to use less. Sometimes it's hard to stop using resources completely. But you can always try to reduce the amount we use. You can save materials by buying fewer new toys. Before you get something new, have a look at what you already have. You might find you've got exactly what you need. Reuse means to use resources in a new way once we have finished using them for their original purpose. This is an opportunity to get creative. Instead of throwing an item out, think of another way you could use it. You could use empty jars as food containers, pencil holders, or flower pots. Recycle means to transform waste into things we can use again. When we throw something away, it's important to know what it's made of and how it should be thrown away. Some things can be recycled, and other things go straight to landfill. Items like cans, glass bottles, paper, and some plastics can be sorted and sent to a factory where they are reshaped into brand new items. So next time you go to put something in the garbage, have a look at what material it's made of and put it in the right place. There is only one Earth. We can't just pack our bags and move to another planet if ours becomes too unhealthy which is why we need to look after it. If we all refuse, reduce, reuse, and recycle, we will use less of Earth's precious resources, reduce our waste and pollution, and reuse what we already have, keeping our Earth healthy and happy.